Y'all, look at these cool hoverboards. Hover balls, sorry. My parents found on Amazon. They have these bumpers around them, so no matter how hard you hit it, they're not gonna damage your baseboards. Pretty cool. Kick it again. Um, they come in a two pack. <laughs> First are these Amazon stepping stones. These help promote coordination skills. They are great sensory toys to have, especially indoors on those cold winter months when you can't go outside and play. My boys absolutely love playing floors, lava with these. They are the best, go get them. Next is the Simply Play Wobble Disc. I was so hesitant to get this for my kids, but honestly, I'm so glad that I did because this is one of their absolute favorites. They are on this thing nonstop. They use it like this, or they flip it over and use it as a large stepping stone or just something that they can jump off of and, and play with. And of course, we got it off Amazon. Next is this three-in-one climbing wooden arch Montessori, I'm not really sure what to call it set. Um, if you've been on the fence about getting your kids one of these, just go get it. I think this one was $100 on Amazon. My boys use this probably every single day. They absolutely love it. There's so much to it. It's a slide, but you can also flip it over and it's a rock wall. Or you can take both the ramps off and then it becomes like a cute little chair. Um, ours did not come with the padding like this. We actually had a special order it on Etsy, I think, but totally worth it. for Christmas and you're wondering what Tonys are worth it, what Tonys your kids will actually listen to, I'm going to go over my top favorite Tonys. We've bought in a ton, we've sold a ton, we've traded a lot in the buy sell trade. I'm going to go over what has lasted my family the last year that we still listen to every day. Starting with creatives, your children definitely need creatives. You can put whatever track, whatever songs, whatever stories you want on them. So we have a Yeti and then I have this little bat. I put our Halloween songs on this one. A Blippi, pretty self-explanatory. My toddler has Blippi on that. Then I have a superhero. The superhero has superhero stories, Marvel stories um, for my older kid. And then on the Yeti, we have some fun, like super simple songs. Creatives are cheaper than like an actual Tony character and you can customize them to whatever you want. So I definitely think one or two creators for Christmas is perfect. Moving on to Tonys that have correlating books. We have Brown Bear, Brown Bear, Dragons Like Tacos, and Very Hungry Caterpillar. I can definitely say that these are the least annoying Tonys. They keep my kids' attention. They're great if you have the books. And the narration is so cute. Especially for Dragons Like Tacos. Oh my god. It's adorable. Moving on to characters, my son is three and his top two character Tonys would be a Cookie Monster and a Blue. We have many other ones. We have all the Paw Patrol characters. We have all the Coco Melon characters and the Coco one drives me nuts, so do not buy it. Um, but Cookie Monster, super cute and Blue's Clues has really cute songs. I also have an older kiddo and there's really not a lot of content for older kids, but he does love the Pete the Cat Tonys. Um, there is one that I'm missing, so if you have like a kid five and up, I think Pete the Cat is perfect. Last but not least, I have two interactive type of Tonys. I have Healthy Habits Hippo and I have Captain Dreambeard. Um, Healthy Habits Hippo is like you're waking up in the morning, you're starting your routine, you're starting your day, it has some affirmations, it's super cute. And then I have Captain Dreambeard. This is a nighttime one. Regulating your breathing, how to get to sleep, how to have good dreams. And I love these. 
Captain Dreambeard is personally my favorite. He is so cute. But overall, my kids' top two favorite Tonys would definitely be Brown Bear, Brown Bear, and any type of creative because you can customize them, delete the content off of them, put new content. And I would say if you could only get two Tonys, do a Brown Bear and do a creative. Okay, Yodo players are on sale. If you have kids, these would make amazing birthday gifts, Christmas gifts. These are even great to put on the list for grandparents to buy because then for future holidays or birthdays, they can just get the kids more cards. Um, I was introduced to this last year by April Lynch. She's on TikTok and she had a great post about why she chose the Yodo player and I immediately bought them and I have to say they are worth the hype. My kids use their Yodo players every single day. We have done several screen-free road trips with only the Yodo players, which you, if you would have told me I would be driving five hours to a rodeo with my kids without an iPad, I would have said you're crazy, but we have done it. Um, they have two different sizes. This is the regular size. This is the mini. If I were to do it all over again, I would probably just get the mini and I might buy another mini um, because these are just great to have in the car. You can put them in your diaper bag and they're a lot more easily to transport than the regular size. Downside of the mini is sometimes I will lose this thing. I'm like, oh crap, where did the mini go? Um, so the regular is nice if you're strictly going to have it in the home. The regular is charged by like a magnetic charging station thing and then the mini is just a regular charger so it's nice because if you're in the car and this thing dies you can just plug it in so let's talk about some of the cards um well first let me put this in i'll show you kind of what it looks like so there's just like little pixels that are played um so there's like one per story and so it's really great because it still kind of keeps the kids interest but it's not an actual screen my girls love these ladybird cards and they're all extremely educational there's one about egypt um we have rainforests let me flip this so doing a little flip through we love these five minute stories because it's just great for little little brains um they have amazing stories like full-on stories that your kids can listen to and these are all just ones that we have bought either on mercari or through sales they also have a lot of like meditation and sleeping ones, lots of educational ones as well. And we just really love these. Sometimes Dolly loves to just listen to the crackling fire. Um, so these are just some of the ones that we have and I'm definitely going to be purchasing more because we love them so much. So let me just kind of do, you can also make your own, which I have not done yet, but you can import books or different audio files onto these and the make your own cards hold a ton and you could put full on books like people put harry potter books on those 